he had been courted by President Recep Tayyip Erdogan and his rival, Kemal Kılıç Daroğlu. On Monday, Sinan Oğan, who came third in the first round of voting held earlier this month, broke his silence, just days before the second round of voting kicks off in Turkey on Sunday. I announce that we will support Mr. Erdogan, the presidential candidate of the People's Alliance, in the second round of the elections. I invite all voters who voted for us in the first round to support Mr. Erdogan in the runoff. One of the reasons he gave was the performance of the ruling party's coalition in legislative polls, which were also held on May 14th. Erdogan's AKP party and its nationalist and Islamist allies obtained a majority in the 600-seat parliament. Owen denied that there had been any bargaining. He said that he and members of his alliance had met both Erdogan and Kılıç Darulu. But the head of the Victory Party, which Owen hails from, quickly sought to distance himself and the party from Owen's decision. Mr. Sinan Owan's statement is his own political choice. His statement does not represent or bind our Victory Party. The statement on behalf of the Victory Party will be made by myself at 11 tomorrow. Erdogan, who has been at the helm for 20 years, took 49.5 percent of the vote in the first round. Next in the lead was Social Democrat Kemal Kılıç Darulu, with 44.9 percent of the vote. Owen followed with considerably less votes, just 5.2 percent. Still, his decision to throw his weight behind Erdogan could prove decisive in this Sunday's runoff vote.